Hi, and welcome to an episode of Shop Talk, where we get to talk about technology here at Palo Alto Networks. Today's topic is the integrated 5G modem on the PA415 5G, which is part of the entry-level hardware line, the PA400 series. I'm Heather Robertson, a Senior Product Marketing Manager, and with me today is Saurabh Hashemi, a Senior Product Manager. Hi, Heather. Hi, Saurabh. Recently, we launched the PA415 5G, which has an integrated 5G modem. Can you tell me what that looks like? What makes it different from a regular PA400 series firewall? Sure, the firewall looks very similar to PA415 with added a cellular modem with four antennas for 5G cellular connectivity. The antennas are on the four corners of the firewall. You can see we have one here to look at. A regular firewall doesn't have these. It's very interesting looking indeed. And if I'm a customer, why would I be interested in purchasing one of these firewalls? What can I do with this that I couldn't do before? Well, the PA415 5G provides secured wireless WAN connectivity. So assume you require a non-wired secondary WAN link. The 5G cellular can act as a backup WAN link to provide connectivity in case the primary wired WAN link goes down. Or if the firewall is being deployed in a rural location where wired WAN is not an option. In such a case, the 5G cellular interface can act as the primary WAN link for the firewall. So the 5G connectivity can act as both a primary or a secondary WAN link? What other WAN link is an option on this firewall? In addition to the traditional Ethernet ports, these units also have an SFP fiber interface that can act as a primary or secondary WAN link. Excellent. So these firewalls are built to provide redundancy and reliable connectivity, even in places where those connections may not be as reliable as desired from their service providers? Exactly. What else does this firewall offer that we should be aware of? The firewall comes with a single 5G modem, but dual SIM slots. It also has an SFP RJ45 combo port connection that can be used for the WAN or LAN. Ah, can you elaborate more on the dual SIM slots? So it's like having two connections in one? Kind of. The dual SIM slot enables you to have a primary W1 connection, but provision for a backup WAN link in case the primary 5G connection fails. For example, you can place two SIMs, one from AT&T and another one from Verizon. In case one network goes down, the other network can take over and resume secure flow of traffic. So you're guaranteed a 5G network connection as long as <clears throat> one of the two networks is up and running? Extra redundancy. That's a nice feature. Exactly. And of course, I have to ask this popular question. Is SD-WAN supported over 5G? Yes. I'm actually pleased to say that PanOS SD-WAN is now supported over 5G for Quasar PanOS 11.2 release. This is an important feature for our customers and will be a popular feature. And this question comes up a lot with our customer base. If our customers have other models of Palo Alto firewalls, will the PA415 5G work with what they have currently installed? Absolutely. This firewall can also be managed with Panorama or Strata Cloud Manager. And there are additional accessories available for this firewall, like an additional power supply. That's a good point. Is this firewall available to deploy in high availability mode? Does it have dual power supplies like the other firewalls? Yes, it does. Actually, these firewalls can be deployed in active-active or active-passive modes for high availability and ship with one power supply, but an additional power supply can be purchased as they are dual power supply capable. Thanks, Sarab. Well, I hope you enjoyed our introduction to our newest addition to the PA400 series, the PA415 5G and all its capabilities. You can reach out to your channel representative or directly to Palo Alto Networks to learn more about this new appliance. Thanks for tuning in. Thank <laughs> you.